Hey gang, have I got an awesome design feature for you today. Wow, people love statistics on websites, primarily because they're easy to digest and it gets a point across really quickly. It's very easy to build a static representation like this inside of the high level page builder, but hold your horses. I'm just gonna scroll to the top, give this page a refresh, and now when I scroll down, boom, check that out. How cool is that? Let's take a look under the hood so you can see how it works. Obviously, I've placed the actual numbers uh, down below the viewport here as we're triggering them when it comes into view. You can update the numbers uh, in the text here using the high level page builder. The real magic is tucked away in the footer section of the tracking code. If you have a little peek in here, you'll see this nifty script here does the hard work for you. The only thing to note really that you need to change is you, if you uh, want to change the speed at which the animation happens, you can do it here. This is in milliseconds. If you want to make it faster or slower, you can just change that number there. The code itself actually references CSS classes inside of the design. So if we jump back down to here, uh, this section here has a custom class called counter, uh, which the script waits until it comes into view before firing the function. Then we have our text elements here, and each one of these has the same custom class of count. As the user scrolls down the page and reaches the section containing all of this, it resets the number to zero and then rises up to the number that you've set here in each text element. Pretty sweet, huh? You can download the funnel via the link in the description below, yours for free to use on your own pages as you see fit. The automation will send you a funnel share link. Just be sure that you're logged into high level when you click on that link and it will automatically import it into your high level account. If you wanted to use a second instance of the number counter, maybe further down the page, head on back to the footer tracking code and simply copy this second bit of script here. Copy that there, leave that bit of script at the top and just paste below. So we now have two versions of that. What you'll need to do is then rename some of the elements here. So if we just call it counted two, counted two, counted two, count two, and then a little bit further down, counted two, and just click save on that. So now if I duplicate this here, and we're just gonna, uh, Rename this section as counter to, and we'll need to rename all of these as count to. Make sure you remove the class that's already in place. Last one. Now, if we preview this page, if I scroll down the first time, that one fires. Scroll down a second time, that one fires as well. So you can have multiple instances, as many as you want, really, as long as you duplicate the code and change all the custom classes. Have fun using it, and I'll see you in the next video.